Good morning. This is Russ and Kitty Walden with Father's Heart Ministry, and this is the Daily Prophetic Word. If you would like to receive the Daily Prophetic Word in your inbox, go to propheticnow.com and click on the subscription link. The Daily Prophetic Word ministers to approximately 80,000 people every month, and we've been doing this now going on four or five years. I'd have to look back, but uh, I, I tell people all the time that some people wake up in the night, and the first thing they do is reach for a pack of cigarettes. I wake up in the night, first thing I reach for is the Word of the Lord. That has an impact upon your life over time. As much as people tell me that the daily prophetic word blesses them, I got to say it's changed me, it's shaped me, it's blessed me in ways that are difficult to exaggerate. The Father says today that this is a time of night season intimacy. As I stood by Paul in the night, so I am coming to you in visitation to stand by you and to cause you to receive that which I would communicate with you. The Father says, I will bring night visions to you. I will open things up to you and draw back the curtain of the natural and show you what's really going on around you in the realm of principalities and powers. You are not isolated or left to yourself. As the young prophet, I will cause you to know that there greater in number are those that are for you than those that are against you opposing. I will make the realm of spiritual things more real and substantial to you than you have ever expected. As Paul, who looked on in the Roman church by the Spirit, so you will awaken and not know whether you went somewhere in the Spirit or in reality. Have you considered translation as a form of transportation? Scoffers may mock and religious authorities ridicule, but as happened to Philip with the Ethiopian eunuch, you will find yourself in one place. And then without reliance on the instrumentality of a natural mode of transportation, you will find yourself in another place. You see, says the Father, you're not a natural being having a spiritual experience. You are a spiritual being having a natural experience in time and space. Adopt this mentality today, knowing that you belong to me and I have you safely tucked away in my pavilion. Though the world, the earth, and all things in the spirit be open to you in vision, discernment, and unveiling, do not be intimidated. Just hold on to my hand, and I will lead you. Do not expect others to understand. This isn't about impressing others. It is about a new place of understanding and authority in me, where I get all the glory, and you get to enjoy the benefits of what I have given you this day, says the Father. What a powerful word. Perhaps you'd like to have one-on-one ministry. You can go to our website, propheticnow.com, and request a pastoral call, a prophetic counseling session, or a prophetic word that is actually returned to you uh, via audio or text. Maybe you had a dream last night. You feel like God is speaking to you. You can request prophetic dream interpretation. Now, why are we doing this? Kitty and I have been tasked by the Father to raise up a relevant prophetic generation. One of the mandates of that is not only to bring the voice of God to you, but to activate you in hearing the voice of God for yourself. If you'll look on our website, you'll see a course description of the five courses that are currently a part of our online prophetic school. Enrollment is now open for course one. Now, what is the prophetic? The prophetic is all about hearing the voice of God and sharing what you hear for the benefit of yourself and the benefit of others. And so you can uh, enroll in the online prophetic course and you will be trained. You'll be trained how to look to see, listen to hear, sense to feel what the Father is saying in your life in an unimpeachable way because he loves you. He loves you, and there's nothing you can do about it. He loves you unconditionally. He loves you no strings attached. Why would he do that? Because he's so convinced that if he can get you to live a presence-driven life, that you'll get in his presence, and you'll be changed. 
You will be forever changed. And you'll come into his likeness and fulfill your destiny. And to that end, that's why we are here. That's why we are bringing this ministry to you. To raise you up to be a person that knows the voice of the Father and responds and reaps the dividends of all that Jesus paid for you when he went to the cross and he bled and died that all of the dividends of the cross would be paid into your life. See, that's what the prophetic is about. Second Chronicles 2020 says, Believe the prophet, so shall you prosper. The prophet is here to bring the benefits of Calvary online in your life, to bring shift and to bring change. Listen to me. Change is available. Change is possible. So go to the website, propheticnow.com. Take, care of the, uh, take uh, advantage of the things that you find there. God bless you. Have a great day.